Hiya and welcome to Tight TV. I've got a special guest on today. I've got Caleb, um, a young Barnsley fan. Uh, he wants to give his opinions and thoughts uh, about players and um, results and things what's not been going our way. So, Caleb, it's nice to have you on board, mate. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, obviously, we lost uh, a pretty uh, poor performance against Derby County 2-0. Uh, what, what's uh, your take on the game? Uh, it was pretty poor uh, poor defeat, wasn't it, Caleb? Yeah, very poor. Do you think right bad? It was it was right bad. Do you think that we we should have at least gone on a bit more attacking and tried to score some goals? Because it didn't seem that way, did it? No, not at all. Uh, you see, you look at like Carlton Morris. Um, he he should have done probably done better. But you look at like Bassey and Styles and that they they seem to be pretty quiet, didn't they? Yeah. Do you they think? Ball. Yeah, they didn't. They didn't really touch ball at all, did they? Um, and you look in midfield. You look at like Matty Wolfe. He got a, a card pretty early on. Do you think we can getting a booking early? Do you think that? What can I say? Do you think it like uh, stopped him from playing what he should be playing? Well, it made us play a bit more ball. Hmm. I think that. I'm thinking that because he picked up a booking as well early, he stopped him playing with his, his normal game. He, he didn't seem to be going in for tackles and that seemed to be holding back. Uh, yeah. Brad Collins, how do you think Brad Collins played uh, in goal? <clears throat> well, he could have done some better saves. Could have done better, definitely. Hmm. It's like when he's kicking ball out as well. You know, when he's kicking ball... It, Sometimes it either goes too long or it goes out of play, doesn't it? It doesn't seem to find our players a lot of time, does he? No. They nearly yeah. made me play Scott, then score. Yeah, exactly. And it comes straight back onto us, doesn't it? Yeah. Who do you think? I mean, I know we lost 2-0, but who what player do you think he, he didn't do too bad? You know, who, who were your player who you thought what, might man a match? Boy. Even though the defence was really poor, it might have been one of the defenders like Anderson or Alec. Hmm. Yeah. Um, I said it, uh, Vita could have had a decent game as well. It, it didn't. It, it was one of them kind of games, I think, uh, Caleb, is that nobody really played really well to stand out for Man at Match, but they did okay as such, if you know what I mean. Yeah. It was an average performance, wasn't it? So. We've got Stoke City uh, at all, well, under lights at night time, midweek game uh, on Tuesday. Do you think that Barnes will come back uh, better? Well, if the defence plays better, then maybe. It's usually the, the defence who let us down. It's usually mm. not the strikers. The strikers do fine, usually. Mm. I know Matty Wolf. Um, he picked up pretty early cards and that. Do you think he'll be dropped? And do you think Benson will probably come in instead of Wolf or Palmer? Or would you keep more or less same side? Would you change any players? Mm, probably Morris. Hmm. I don't know who to the probably. I don't know, but Ellick and Anderson. I think they played. More, more attacking, but instead of more defensive, even though they're in defence. Yeah. Yeah. I think they were coming forward a bit too much. And like uh, Britain, it seems to be, it seems to be like getting caught out of position, too far, far, further up fit, uh, pitch. So it was like leaving space for them at back half, I was thinking. <coughs> um, going back to Morris, um, I think he's frustrated. Because he, he won't won't get any chances. I think Styles and Bassey, Queener, I think they could have like helped him out a bit as well and like push a bit further up front. Because I think Bassey were pretty quiet. I don't know about you. Do you think Bassey and Styles were quiet? Yeah, to what they usually are. Hmm. I mean, you you look at a game before against Middlesbrough. I mean, Bassey scored two goals, and then when you watched him on Derby. I don't think it, it for me it didn't seem as if we were on pitch playing. It was pretty back quiet, I think. None of them 
it didn't look like any of them wanted a win. Good, very good point about Caelan because there's a few people who have said that it looked like that they didn't really look interested in, in game and we wanted a win, didn't we? You know what I mean? Yeah, I think, I think Derby looked more positive and they wanted win. I think they wanted it. You could tell they wanted it because I were attacking, but just what you said there, Caelan, is that it we didn't just didn't look interested, and even when we were losing 2 0. We still didn't bring like an attacking option on like a Devante call for try and get a goal back. I think that's what frustrated a lot of people as well. To be fair, I don't I think Cole he can definitely play better because I think he's just dropping. Hmm. Yeah. He's he's like in and out at side, isn't he? He's not uh, yeah. one minute he's starting, the next minute is he's on bench, <laughs> isn't he? So that that's a good point as well. It's you know if we were like losing 2 0, surely you think bringing a, a, a striker and an attacker to try and get a goal back, but we didn't. That, that's mm. frustrated, wasn't it? That was weird. <coughs> um, I'm thinking it might keep same side against Stoke. I've just got a, a little niggle at the back of my head thinking it might rest Matty Wolf because we've got Stoke on, mm. uh, we've got Stoke midweek and then we've got Fulham on Saturday. So we've got two quick games, haven't we? So um I'm gonna go for score predictions. Uh I'm gonna say I don't know if I'm right or wrong, by the way. I'm hoping I'm right because we want to win. We all want Barnsley to win. Um I'm gonna say two one Barnsley. I don't know what you'll think. What, what, well, what if you... the defence doesn't step up the game, it will probably be like two one to them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, very, very true, mate. Yeah, very true. I think uh, defence and midfield, I think everybody, I think we can agree on that, everybody needs to really up the game from Saturday, don't we? Yeah, definitely. Um, I'm going to say, if, if Morris starts tomorrow, I'm going to say Morris one goal and hmm, I think Bassey another goal. Because he's got, we've got to start, Bassey's got to start playing, a, you know, Ari Kando. Uh, but mm, so are you were saying two one stock or are you going? Probably, yeah, yeah. <coughs> That's it. It's all about opinions, isn't it? So, but and, and, and like what you said before, Caleb, is that these players now we've got to show a big difference. Like I said, defense, midfield, we've got to really play better to give us any chance against Stoke because it's going to be a, a. I mean, Stoke are a pretty decent side. The I know they're struggling at the minute, but when they do play, they, they've got some dangerous players. What what can hurt us? I mean, they've got yeah. um, an old Barnsley player, Jacob Brown. He could could come back to Barnsley and onto Scunny. Yeah. So yeah, be interesting that. Be interesting. So I'm saying a win. Caleb's saying Stoke, but I know he wants Barnsley to win because we all want Barnsley to win. But at the end of the day, it's all about opinions and is like what is uh, what Caleb said. Is that if we don't up his game, then Stoke will win two one. And I think uh, people what watches this will probably agree with Caleb and say, yeah, we need to vastly improve his game. So Caleb, I want to thank you, mate, for joining me on Tights TV. Will we be able to get you on in future for any more games? Would you be interested in that? Yeah. Yeah. So what I'll do, I'll get in contact with you again. Um, either Fulham game or Bristol City. We'll try and work a, a time out what's good for you. And uh, we'll get your opinions on that. All being well, we can have a win against Stoke. But uh, and then we'll have another talk about that and see how we've gone in Stoke. And then we'll take it into his next game. So I'll be in contact with you, Caelan. Is that OK? Yeah. Appreciate it. I want to thank all fans that are watching uh, Tykes TV. Please leave your like, comment and subscribe below. Uh, agree with me or agree with Caelan. Um, and I think Caelan's touched on some great points here. But Bounds vastly need to up the game. Uh, to out like a chance against uh, a win because that's what we do need to stop uh, stop us in this league. So one thing left to say, you Reds. Mm -hmm.